Hey guys, good YouTube, Southern Mountain here. And just when we think that we're winning a fight and we're really pushing back against people who would restrict our rights to own and carry and keep and bear arms, Second Amendment, keep tearing at bay, sometimes I think, why are we winning? And we just relax. But then you think you're winning, but then like something like this happened. Colorado has just passed a bill, four bills is what I hear. Uh, they limit the size of ammunition and magazines and universal background checks. So what it looks like here, you can only have 15 round magazine and a firearm and eight rounds and a shotgun. Uh, and person to person sales all have to go through background checks and blah, blah, blah. And, uh, uh, I'm sure there's more to it. I really haven't got into it. Um, but it's, uh, let's see. Yeah. Yeah, they haven't really decided to ban stadiums and other stuff. They're still just going through it. But what it is, knee jerk. What I, what I'm looking here online, the uh, Colorado is very one of the most democratic houses in America, and I don't know why Democrats hate guns. Uh, I don't know. Uh, I. I think it's because they're going because their guy says it's bad and they're just locked stuff. I don't really like that when, you know, what, what, everybody should think for themselves and stuff. Quit just, you know, going by what their team says. Because this is bull crap. And, um, I don't know how to beat this. I mean, I know in South Carolina we're really fighting hard. We're passing a bill. Now, we just passed a bill now for we can, um, carry our weapons into bars well or it needing to establish that care because you think a bar oh my god you don't want to be drunk in a bar and have a gun it's not like that if you go to any restaurant a mexican place they serve alcohol before you couldn't go in there so if i'm like go eat with my family at a mexican place they serve alcohol i couldn't carry my firearm in there now i think they got i think it's already passed one i think it's gonna go past the other thing i can't uh, you know, but I can't drink. But, but a lot of times we, me and the wife go some places, I couldn't have it. So that's great. And also my state of South Carolina, they're trying to pass a bill where, um, that, uh, any male over the age of 17 or 18, able-bodied male or whatever is part of the state militia. So that, you know, that railway like regulate just a little extra, just keep the government at bay where they can't take our firearms. And of course, this is Democrat guy is all like, it's a nonsense bill because the government will ever, never want to do that. Then, well, well then pass it there. <laughs> Why are you blocking it, man? If it's a nonsense bill in the government, because he knows good and well they want the guns. That's, you know, that's tricky. You can tell when they want it. They say, oh, you don't need it. You, I love it when people say, oh, they're not going to take your guns. I said, well, then okay, just say they're not going to take it. Let's go ahead and put it hard and stone. Not going to take it. And they won't do it because they know they want them. You know, they just that thin in your wedge. They want that camel on the, just a little bit at a time. We just want this and then we ain't gonna forget that. We saw how they did Europe and all the other places in the country. We saw, we see the game plan. So we're not falling for that. Alright guys and girls, you too. Uh, keep up the good fight and hopefully we can keep, turn this stuff around. But, I, I'm just shocked about what the uh, Colorado did, you know. And, uh, Poor, poor guys. I'll just keep up the fight and we'll try to do what we can on this end and keep fighting, alright? No, come on.